Hello YouTube, Batman Original here, bringing you another cooking video. Today be... Blah, 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 blah. Here we go. Uh-uh, get going. Get going. <laughs> Hello YouTube, Batman Original here, bringing you another cooking video. Today we're going to be cooking some pork enchiladas. Got some ground pork right here. Got some soft tortillas. Got some chipotle enchilada sauce with roasted onion garlic. Refried beans. Couple peps. Kobe Jack. Mexican rice. El Pinto salsa stuff. Chilies. And some lettuce. And sour cream in the fridge. And sour cream. So what we're going to do first, fellas and fella F, we're going to get our uh, oven going. We're going to go on and chop these little peppers up. Excuse me, hooch. And then I'm going to stab myself. Just kidding. Don't do that, kids. All right. We're going to cut the ends off of these. Like so. Don't want that. And we're just going to chop them up in little bits like this. These are jalapenos and I guess uh jalapeno. What the hell's that one? Jalapeno. Oh uh, red jalapeno? Yeah. Dang. I didn't know they even had this. It's a cayenne. Alright, cayenne pepper. Uh, I'm gonna chop them up like this and we're gonna throw these in there with the pork. That way the pork gets that nice uh, pepper flavor and it cooks all in there and it's not so hot for the people that don't like hot stuff. So we're going to let that pan heat up real quick, and once it heats up, then, uh, then we're going to throw all that stuff in there, so we'll be right back. Oh. So now what we got going, we got the ground pork, got these two pots going, got this on uh I right, put this on low the beans and then this is heating up for the rice. Got two and a half cups of water right here. We gotta get some butter. Lando lakes. So we're gonna go on and throw these peppers in here. Like so. A little bit of garlic. Ward off the vampires. A little bit of pepper. Gotta season your meat, kids. Can't be eating that bland shit. Ain't eating none of that bland shit around here. Oh, <laughs> shit. I felt something. Back on the lid came off. Getting pepper everywhere, folks. Next, we're going to do some of this reptilian. Can we do a full thing? Yeah. Some of this reptilian oh, salt. So that pork was probably salty as well. Mix that all around with them peppers. Like so. Oh shit, y'all back. So now we're going to add the rice, Mexicano rice, two and a half cups of water, and old Grego's favorite, some butter. That make it nice and fluffy. Read the ingredients, kids. Stir, blah blah blah, heat to boiling. And cover and that will cook about 25 minutes. So in YouTube world, that's about 10 hours. 
got the beans going. Always make sure you hydrate your beans that way they don't dry out. Got the, the pork going with the, the peppers. And I forgot to mention, you can take these little capsules right here, the ends that we cut off, and you use them as pasties, or you can use them as earrings. All right, so now this is boiling. Nice and good, we're gonna turn that down to about two. Gonna get the lid, pop that stuck on there. And it says it takes 25 minutes. So in YouTube world, that's about 36 hours. So in about 36 hours, we'll be back and we'll see how the rice is. Beep. Just kidding. So now we're gonna take our big pan Spray the bottom of that. Coat it nice and good. That way the tortilla don't stick. We're gonna take our torch. We're gonna throw them in the microwave for a couple minutes. Soften them up. Second, you mean? Huh? You said a couple of minutes. A couple seconds. Yeah, don't put it in there for a couple of minutes because they will turn black. Like seven seconds is good. I'm gonna flip them a little bit. Kind of alternate them. Throw them back in there. Make sure you put it on the popcorn section, kids. And there go. So now we go back to our station. We take one of the tortillas. Put a little bit of bean. And the main thing, kids, is not to put a lot of uh, ingredients. Yeah, we can probably use this too, it ain't gonna matter. The rice. All going to the same place, folks. Rice. Get a little bit of that ground pork right here. Some of them pips. Throw that in there like that. Get some of these tomatillos. Tomatillo. Gonna get some lettuce. The cheese is gonna go on top, so. Do you wanna add sour cream on the inside or no? Nah, we'll put that on top. Spread. Tuck. Like a little diaper. And roll. Just like that. <laughs> So you're going to do that about 30,000 times. Beans. Rice. Pork. Cocaine. Uh, 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 More let, fold, tuck, and roll. Just like that, folks. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna fill that up, and then we're gonna put the rest of the ingredients on there. So we'll be right back in a second. All right, so now, once we got these all rolled up, we're gonna take, I guess, pour the sauce on there first. Shake well, like it says, already done that. Spread that all around. Like so. And the shit smells good. Get every last drop, kids. That is authentic. Grand Luchitis. Luchito. Cabron. We're going to take uh, 
Make sure you spread that on there. Spread it evenly. Almost had it's supposed to be like a red sauce, but it almost smells like salsa. Like pizza sauce. It look good though. Let's hope it tastes good. We're gonna take the rest of this beef. Ooh, I got a kick. Holy balls. Ooh. I said it was medium. Mm, damn, that's good. It does taste authentic. Authentico. It had like a uh, like two different kinds of those uh, little chitio things at Wally World. Like a green chili and uh, something else. So we're going to try those next time. Take the cheese. Spread it all around. God, I had a cheese. Try not to get it all over the place like I do. And if you do, make sure you clean up, folks. Don't want those rats coming out, those pesky old rats. Spread it on there like that. I think they would put the sour cream on it after it comes out of the oven. Yeah. Probably be a better idea. Don't want no hot sour cream to boat. Make sure you spread it all around. Got the oven preheated to 250. These won't take long because it's pretty much all cooked already so mm -hmm. coach is trying to direct me on how to spread my cheese and then the rest goes on her head thank you great value you bloody world for paying me for that i will gladly take take my check on tuesday so make sure all that shit spread like that. Cover all the corners. And into the oven it goes, kids. Now with adult supervision, so you don't burn your hand out like that. You don't burn your hand like I just did. Why these on in there? I might have to. Uh, might have to put both of them. Do those separately. So we'll do that one separate and that one. And you want to probably cook that for, uh, start it out about 20 minutes or so. So in 20 minutes, we'll check on it and see how it is, folks. Be right back. All right. Here come the enchiladas. Yes sir, yes sir, gather round, gather round. Danielle, you said. And the egg casserole. Get bubbling. All right. What y'all think of that? I think K1 didn't know. Mmm, burnt glass. I love the smell of burnt glass. Uh, let's go on and kind of split them up. Oh yeah, they're good eating boats. Normally we put a little bit of lettuce on the top, but we uh, put most of it on the inside. So either way, I mean, same thing, same difference. Split these up. Barely even see him. One of those has four. <laughs> I don't know where at though. I'm going to add the sour queen. Make sure you mix it. Mix it for some odd reason. Because the liquid says on the top. Mm -hmm. It's going to be liquid in my mouth. Oh. Alrighty. <laughs> Dollar for Daisy. 
Come on now, Daisy. How the hell they get it to doll up like that on the damn TV? How they do that? I have no clue. If you know, comment below how Daisy gets her dollops. Dolloped. Like they do on TV. Because they fling that shit and it, boop. See, it ain't even coming off the damn spoon. <laughs> More like a damn sink, <laughs> sink and wait for a day. Ain't no damn dollop. <laughs> Hell, peanut butter comes off easier than that. Mm, spread her on out. Yeah, you're laughing at. <laughs> Watching it try to spread. Mm -hmm. Pooch thinks that spreading sour cream is funny. All right. Do you want to live another day? Nope. As long as I can eat first. Mm. Then you can kill me. Nah. Then you can kill me. We're gonna spread all that out, folks. If y'all don't like sour cream, then you fuck. Anyways, we're gonna get this out of the way. <laughs> get our uh, trusty spatula. Try to scoop one of these suckers up. Oh, Sally Mae. She's trying to get away from me. Thank you. <laughs> Bada bing. And bada boom. So now, we're going to tuck on in. This is enchiladas. That in an original way. That good. That really good. Got the beef. It's not too hot. It's not even really all that hot. I don't even have no kick. I think the sour cream kind of toned that down. Oh yeah, get a good look at that. Yes sir. Oh yeah. That real good. Hmm? Anyway guys, hope y'all enjoyed this video. Thumb it up if you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more videos. And we'll see you later. Ah. Try to play it up. So here is the final masterpiece. Just chop it up in little squares. If I can get it and serve that on thick. That's what she said. I need the fork and the knife this one. I can cut the daggone thing. Bear with me, folks. So many fucking layers. Cheese. Alright, finally. Fork. Huh? Try on out, folks. What y'all think? Here we go. 
Ginger. Nice and flaky. Check that out. Yes, sir. Oh, I smell white. in the fucking background. <laughs> Is it good? Yeah, that's good. Really good. Like I said earlier, probably, um, probably can use two things of gravy to get that full gravy effect. Man, this is good. The sauces are good. The bacon is good. Everything good. Oh well. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this recipe. Turn the video up if you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more videos. And we'll see you later.